We've been waiting a long time for this. It's an 80 piece wholesale box from Jam Vintage, AKA Vintage Mystery Box. I'm so excited for this because it's been forever since the last wholesale box I've gotten. This box was supposed to get here yesterday, but there was uh, like some really bad ice in Oklahoma where it was at, so they delayed it a day. Which kind of sucks, but I, got a, I had a lot of stuff I had to get done, and I got done. And holy shit, boys, the very first one on the top. But they sent me this. This is the only tee that I saw when they said they were working on my box and we're almost done. It's this Ghost Rider versus Wolverine. Now, I'm no Marvel addict. I don't know shit about comics or anything. It's an insane Ghost Rider with Wolverine. Uh, it's on an old Fruit of the Loom tag, size large. So, uh, so with these 80-piece wholesale boxes, it comes with eight fragiles. So there's a stack of 10 t-shirts. One of them is a uh, crazy grail, I guess. So this one's on an old Hanes 100% cotton, size XL. It is a Doobie Brothers. Let's see what the date is on this. I think it's like 88. Uh, yeah, this one's pretty cool. A very nice single stitch, uh, blank. Doobie Brothers, pretty cool graphic. And I like that that back hit. That's pretty cool. The sunglasses and the eyes. I don't know who they are. Sorry, but uh, I'll get educated on this. That's, that's the cool thing about these wholesale boxes and just thrifting in general. I don't know a lot of stuff, and I learn as I go. So uh, we got a Harley size large. This one's a pretty good one. It is a 1991. Uh, it's a very nice blank. It's got an amazing fade going on. Uh, yeah, New Zealand, pretty cool graphic right there. Then on the back, you got the New Zealand shop hit. Yeah, this is a very clean Harley Harley piece. Pro player, size XL, made in USA. This one is going to be Alomar. No idea who it is. Uh, Baltimore Orioles. So yeah, but it's a pretty cool, it's a blank back, but it's a pretty cool uh, t-shirt. I played hockey, I'm not big into baseball, but uh, yeah, this is a pretty cool t-shirt for a guy I don't even know. Going to this one, we got the McDonald's Bill Elliott. I love NASCAR tees. Uh, they're some of my favorite t-shirts. So it's the Made in USA. Let's see what the size is on this joint. Size so large. Uh, but yeah, Bill Elliott, McDonald's, NASCAR tees are always sick. It's got the Batman too. McDonald's and Batman. It is a Hanes Ultra Weight, size extra large. It's a 1993 Chicago World Tour. Uh, pretty simple piece, but it's got that wraparound graphic going around on the back. Pretty cool. We got this Delta, size large. It is a Cleveland, the Cleveland Bad Boys, blank back. Uh, this is an awesome graphic as well. Uh, it's actually really, really cool. Cleveland Bad Boys, what you gonna do when they come for you? Size extra large, 1991. It's gonna be Marvin the Martian. Very simple, but it's got a cool color. Um, pretty clean condition too, so it's got the Martian on the front. On the back, it's out there, it's his little gun. Moving on, we got this college concept, size large, and it's gonna be a Detroit Lions. Uh, blank back, this is a really cool one, I think. Lions football, getting the game, even though the Lions kind of suck. This is cool, he's coming out of the TV, grabbing the shit. So yeah, that's a pretty cool tee if you're a Lions fan. It's a size double XL. Uh, it's a Dale Senior, this thing is pretty fucking big. Uh, but yeah, Night Train. Yeah, it's a pretty, pretty simple little uh, Dale piece. You can't go wrong with these. Uh, Dale's probably the most popular NASCAR driver, uh, and his tees sell, you know, very well. Cool little graphic there. Now we're moving on to the second stack. So uh, we got another fragile right here. And I don't know if you already saw it, but it's this Hanes Heavyweight Size XL Casper Pepsi Promo. Now these pop off. Like these Casper promos are insane. I honestly don't get the hype around them, but I can see why once you hold it in your hands. It's actually a really cool design. Got a size large Taz Harley. Uh, some of these Harley tees, especially the Looney Tunes collabs, they tend to fit boxy. Now look how wide this one is. Pretty fucking wide, but me like Harley. Big, big task. Black back. Here we got a size large Delta blank. It is a Pittsburgh Steelers. Let's see the 1994. Ooh, double-sided. This is a good one. T. Uh, it's got all their faces on there. Super sick. I love these kind of shirts. And the back hit to top it all off. Get in, sit down, and hold on till the Super Bowl. This one's dope. This will be a good seller because the Steelers are doing pretty fucking good this year. Uh, so shout out to all those Pittsburgh fans out there. It's XL and a jersey's blank. The single stitch MLK. This one is 
This one's sick. This is a dope one. King, the dream, lives in me. Then on the back, you got Prince of Peace, then some quotes. Yeah, this one's awesome. It's a pretty cool one. Moving on, we got this Caribbean Dream. So, oh, it's like an American Thunder type joint. Uh, this fade is actually insane. It's like basically gray. But you got, uh, you know, like a Native American holding up a skull. It's like lightning in the back. Colors on this are insane. Travis Scott vibes for sure. Definitely something he'd wear. This is a dope one with an insane fan. Fan sportswear size XL. It's gonna be a Bulls. Looks like a bootleg. Uh, it's definitely got like a bootleg vibe uh, tag on there. Chicago Bulls, five time NBA champions, 1997 NBA finals. This one is super clean. Digging it. This one also has a pretty fucking dope fade on it too. So far, this box has potential to be the best one yet. I'm loving every single piece. So here we got a 3D emblem. This one, I'm telling you guys, these fades are fucking crazy. I, was, I hope you can see them on the camera. But you got this big eagle. I found one of these in the wild before. Sold it for some decent money. It's a 91 3D. Pretty crazy. And on the back it, you got Earl Smalls, Atlanta, Georgia. You got a very simple Sherry's Best uh, mini. Very simple. Just a hot pink Depop type piece. Uh, in the middle you got mini and it's embroidered black back yeah very cool little simple piece we got a fruit of the loom best looks like a george Strait super fire uh george Strait little rap t vibe chilling on a horse in the back you got the usa tour with all the dates george Strait, country legend we got a jersey size large kiss let's see what the what the date is on this one so it's a 1990 kiss uh you know Big, big graphic on the front, pretty sick. On the back, got the simple Hot in the Shade 1990. To this next stack, let's see what this banger is. It's looking to be like a rap tee. Let's see what this is right here. Uh, so yeah, Backstreet Boys. Backstreet Boys rap tee. This thing's fucking dope. Uh, let's see the tag on this. It is PG88, you know, whatever those Panama tags are. Size XL looks like, it's gonna fit me for sure. It almost looks like a double X, which is pretty strange, but uh, yeah, dope Backstreet Boys. I'm digging it for sure. Rap T. Uh, back. Yeah, super sick. Just look at that graphic. Tell me you don't love it. That shit's fire. Climb into this pile. We got this Bruce Lee the Dragon. Uh, let's see, the, there's no date on here. But I got another one of these in the last wholesale box I got from these guys. I still haven't put it up for sale just because I thought it was pretty dope. Yeah, Bruce Lee the Dragon, very simple, black bag. Here we got this 101 Dalmatians promo. This thing is fucking dope. This is actually fucking hard. You got this big, big graphic with the Dalmatian. Wearing a dope little hat, blank back, but you got this little, this little hit right there. This thing is sick. Look at this tag. Ignore my nails because they're kind of nasty from digging in the bins. Uh, yeah, dude, this thing is sweet. Yeah, that's actually a really underrated tee, I feel like. Next, we got this giant size large made in the USA. A dope corn tee. Uh, yeah, 2000 Tour Corn. This one's sweet. I used, I used to listen to corn a lot, not so much, but uh, I went in that little slipknot and corn phase. 1990 Holoback, so it's not a 3D. Uh, but yeah, this fade is insane. Very simple, but awesome. It's got that little bronze foil going on in the design. If you guys can tell, I'm all stuffed up. My allergy has been fucked these last few months. Like, it's not like a new thing. Just like the last few months, my allergy has been absolutely fucking me. Uh, but here we got this, what is this? This ain't no Jeff Gordon. Maybe I'm reading that wrong, but uh, it's like those fucking, whatever those cars are called. Jeff Gordon, I guess, 1990. Uh, this T is on a Fruit of the Loom blank. The tag has been dyed, so this T has been dyed. Uh, pink. But I don't know. <laughs> Jeff Gordon in one of those little cars. I don't know. That's sick though. Next one's going to be a Nutmeg size XL. It's going to be an Indianapolis 500. It's like those locker room tees you see of all the sports teams. Uh, but it's just going to be NASCAR. Haynes Beefy T size large made in USA. It's going to be the 1994 World Cup double sided. This one's going to need a nice soak. But I usually soak all the white tees unless they're actually pristine out of the box. Uh, but yeah, just gotta get this nice and clean, but it's pretty cool. Got that little 
uh, back hit as well. Crazy little colors. I dig these soccer tees because they got all the flags on them, a lot of colors, just looks cool. So here we got a Hanes Beefy T XL. It's gonna be a U2 tour. Let's see the date on this. 1991. I just remember when you got your phone and it had the U2 album already on it. <laughs> no one knew why, but they must have got paid bang for that because all your phones came with U2 music on it. We got another Harley T size large. This one's fucking cool. That's an awesome graphic, so it's a very crispy, it looks very new. It's definitely been washed before, but it's one of those fun wear graphics, which I think should be worth more. Uh, and on the front, you just got that little pocket hit, very simple. All right, moving on, this is going to be the, the banger of this next stack. We got this Lee Made in USA size large. Uh, Pearl Jam Alive T. Now this one is dope. It's got the back hit. If you guys watched my last wholesale box from these guys, not the Bulls one, but the one before that, like the 80 piece or whatever it was. I got a Pearl Jam Alive T in that one, but it did not have the dates on the back. This one does. Uh, looks to be like a bigger large for sure. I don't know, maybe it's the boxy large. Uh, but having the songs on the back, definitely dope. Next one is going to be a very simple Limp Biscuit. Uh, it's 1998. Limp Biscuit is better than everyone. That's literally it. So we got this Mickey Unlimited. This thing is huge. This thing looks like a fucking 3X, but yeah, this is a dope little Mickey wrap tee. We got Delta Pro weight size XL. Uh, Simpson, Homer Simpson, chrome face, blank back, very clean tee. Uh, it's got some yellowing on the front, if you can see that on the white part. But other than that, pretty cool. Seven logo, made in USA. Uh, it looks to be, it's an extra large. Uh, Shaquille O'Neal, pretty dope. Jersey shirt. It feels very, it feels like dead stock. I'm gonna have to check. If it's in a rag, I don't think it's gonna be uh, dry wrap. No, we're good. Uh, but yeah. Shaquille O'Neal jersey shirt. Here we got a, another Harley, size large. It's gonna be a 1996 Daytona joint. Bike week, huge hit on the back. On the front, you get that pretty tropical looking little vibe there. Haynes Beefy T, size XL. It's gonna be a very simple Universal Studios Hollywood. No hit on the back. That one's pretty cool. Garment Graphics, double XL. This one's gonna be a Tweety Bird. No cares. This thing's huge. Fuck it for the big boys, blank back. Yet another Mickey T. This one's gonna be both of them. Just the front hit, but it's pretty cool. Massive graphic, cool colors. Blank back. Double XL, uh, Lion T, or Tiger. It's like a snow, snow tiger, right? Yeah. It's a snow tiger, snow leopard, whatever. Blank back, incredible fade. Huge, huge front print. All right, so we're moving in. This is gonna be the next stack. This is gonna be the banger. Winterland size XL made in USA. Pantera all over print. This one is dope. You got the same thing on the back. I don't know, I think Travis might've worn this. I know he's worn some Pantera tees that made him go up in price. It's good for sellers, bad for buyers, but I think it's a dope little design. Nothing crazy, but dope. Here we got a, uh, a 1993 Cleveland Browns Magic Johnson tee. This one's dope. It's going all over to the sleeves. Uh, Browns are actually doing decent this year. I don't know. They're getting they're getting there. But yeah, this is a dope tee for sure. Should be a good seller too. We have yet another Harley tee. It's going to be another pocket tee. Uh, simple on the back. But this, it's got like a little acid wash fade going on there. I'm not sure if that's how it came. Or someone did that, but it's got a little simple pocket hit. We got a changes size large. It is a simple the Joker. So that's the only hit on it. The Joker, uh, pretty good. Back hit. 2000 DC Comics. We got another Mickey Unlimited tee. It's going to be Donald Duck. Ooh, front and back hit. So that one's pretty cool. It's got Donald, the bright colors going on. Same hat on the back. Pretty cool. Uh, Anita Power tee size large. It's going to be Reggie White, the Green Bay Packers. Um, I don't see a date on here. It's only got that front hit, but it's another one of those caricature uh, tees. Reggie White, Green Bay, Minister of Defense, super dope. It's a dope piece. Here we got another giant size XL, a Jimmy Buffett Domino College, class of 1995. I fucking love Jimmy Buffett. The dates on the back, pretty cool. Disney looks to be like a 70s or 80s, uh, one of those Heather Ringers. 
super cool. Actually a decent size too, um, like a large, so that's pretty cool. Nutmeg, size medium, Dallas Cowboys. Yet another one of those nutmeg locker room tees. The Gateway tee size large, but it's very, very small and shrunk. Uh, 1989, Bart Simpson, radical dude. Look at this, it's supposed to be size large. It's tiny, it's like a smaller or medium. Pretty cool though. Ooh, so this one's looking dope. Changes, size XL, my size. They know I fuck with Pearl Jam, which is where I got this one from. Uh, so they, even my size too, changes, size XL. Got the Pearl Jam 2000 World Tour. That back is fucking crazy. This is so dope. So you peep that on the front and the back. Look at the colors. Insane. So sick. Fuck. So this is a keeper. Sorry guys. If anyone wanted this, this is gonna be a keeper. Keeping all my Pearl Gen tees. Besides, I might sell the Alive, but this one's dope as fuck for sure. We got a Wild Oats size XL, Taz Christmas tee. Perfect Christmas coming up. Um, yeah, this should be a good seller. Front and back hit. We got a Liquid Blue size L Bills tee. Bills are doing good this year. Another hot seller right here. Appreciate you, Jam Vintage, throwing in the good teams. Size large, hardly is my soul. 1989 so yeah this is an older one uh cool it looks really clean for this graphic on the back you got the biker with the girl on the back that's a that's one of the best shot pits i've seen look at that look at that down there in the ghetto the double xl made in usa 1985 so it's not a 3d emblem uh, but it's an 85 harley wicked see-through distressing on the back, you got the shot pit in Ohio, but yeah, this one is very old, 85. We got two dope 80s Harley tees right there. 97 Bulls, oh uh, yeah, pretty cool. Can't go wrong, logo athletic, Bulls, love the colors on there. It is a 1997 chalk line, Cleveland Indians, very simple, no back hit. Sun Sportswear says large, it's gonna be a 94 Warner Bros. Uh, I love these. They're in good sizes and in good shape. Uh, see that front hit? It's pretty dope. But on the back, we got Taz. I love those double-sided Looney Tunes tees. I think they're awesome. We got an 80s Disney one-size-fits-all. Cruella Duville, man. This thing is fucking crazy. This ain't even the banger of the stack. This one is definitely going to be one of the best ones out of the box. Cruella Duville tee, dude. This, this graphic is huge. Yo gonna need a good soap but damn don't even think about talking to me before i've had my coffee got this d generation x let's see what the year is 2002 d generation x that's a good one uh you got them on the front triple h Shawn michaels in the back got their asses it's pretty cool uh, so this banger is going to be a brockham size xl pink floyd 1994 uh this one's dope you guys seeing all you guys have all seen these fucking Pink Floyd tees, I don't really need to do any explaining. 94, European tour, pretty cool, great size. We got a starter, size large, 98, uh, Bulls champions. I literally have the same shirt. I got it from my Bulls box that I got from them. Uh, I think mine's an XL though. Yeah, same one, Bulls tour, dope, dope tee for sure. The Haynes beefy tee, size large, it's gonna be a Star Trek. Oh, uh, dude, this one's sick. So look at the subtle details on this. You see the Star Trek's got the really cool like uh, space theme going on and on the back it's very subtle but it's got like all the stars and like you can see like galaxies in it like stars so that one's pretty cool it's very subtle hint detail thrown in there but I think that makes this tee a lot better here we got a giant tag size XL this one is going to be a cat playing the fucking guitar the blues music festival I don't know. There's a lot of people that collect blues and jazz tees. Uh, maybe this will fit in there. I don't know. I'm not big into that, but Blues Music Festival. Pretty cool. 1997. Here we got another giant tag. Uh, it's going to be a Metallica. 98 Metallica under license to Giant Metallica Garage Inc. Incorporated. Um, dope. Dope tee for sure. Chase Authentic size XL, it's gonna be Jeff Gordon's, uh, you know, like, what do you call it? Race suit, jersey, whatever you wanna say. Uh, T, 
This one is huge, it's the size XL. This thing is fucking massive, it looks like a 3X. Like, look at that. It's damn near to my fucking knees. Yeah, this thing's huge. Uh, but yeah, I love these. The colors on this, super dope. This box has got, is up there for my best box ever, for sure. Uh, we got this size large all sport kiss uh 2000 farewell tour pretty cool uh you got the back hit as well that front print very sick so we got a size xl fruit of the loom i love lucy 1992 cbs promo uh very classic tv show uh it's a timeless one you can always just watch it uh you know it's like when you stay at home from school when you're you were sick just watch i love lucy reruns size medium winterland Incubus, I don't know what that is. Uh, probably a very decent band. But yeah, Incubus, got the small hint in the front and the back. Here we got a Hanes Heavyweight size XL. This one is gonna be a Harley. So it's like a Harley boot. No back hit, the front hit. It's just Harley Davidson. I don't know. That's weird. <laughs> it's, it's a very simple graphic. I don't really know what's going on. It's got like a snake. Big wings on it. I don't know. A size XL on a signal tag 50 50 blend Led Zeppelin. So, lace, lately, I've been listening to a lot more Led Zeppelin, trying to get into it. I love it. Um, I, I really like understand why the older generation always talks about Led Zeppelin so much. Um, I don't. So, here's the timestamp right here 1984. So, this is a dope one. 84 Led Zeppelin, three quarter sleeve. On the back, you got them on there. I'll be a peep that. It's in very good shape. Here we got a Hanes Beefy T XL Phoenix Suns. Very cool. On the back, it's got Bash's Timeout Trivia Sweepstakes. So it's one of those like lottery tees. Arctic Sportswear says large. Made in the fucking US of A, baby. And there's a Taz Halloween. Uh, it's a 94. So yeah, perfect. Halloween is right around the corner, so I'm about to hurry up and fucking sell this one ASAP. And it's got that big Halloween print. Super dope. I could even wear it for Halloween myself. An All Sport size XL. Black Sabbath 99 Tour. So I've also been kind of getting into uh, Sabbath as well. Mainly because of Ozzy. Uh, I think Ozzy's super dope. Uh, yeah. 99 Sabbath Reunion Tour. Insane fade on there. Size large nutmeg. Tampa Bay Devil Rays. I love their t-shirts because their colors are super dope. They just lost the World Series. Not sure if this is going to be a hot seller anymore. Uh, but yeah. Got this Apex One 1991 Italy World Cup. I don't know. This is probably going to be a hard seller. Very specific. Fucking Italy World Cup. Says large Fruit of the Loom. Detroit Bad Boy. So this one is a fucking dope one. Uh, 1988. This one is sick. Detroit Bad Boys. I think it's very underrated team, very clean too. Ooh, this one's dope. XL, dope. We got a fucking Dale Senior, just like that Jeff Gordon T you saw, uh, but it's gonna be Dale Senior. I like this one. Like I told you, I love NASCAR tees. This one looks like it's a proper XL. This one's fucking fire. XL Wild Oats. It's gonna be that Christmas Taz. It's gonna be another hot seller going to Christmas coming up. It's got it on the back too. And then the final t-shirt, let's see what this is. It's going to be a 3D emblem. What a way to finish the fucking box. 91, uh, the strong survive. Sadly, it's got no back it, but I love, I've always wanted this bear 3D emblem. I'll say it right now. I think that was the best box we've ever gotten from these guys. You guys can argue and say it was the one with the Jimi Hendrix mosquito head style all over print tee, or you could say it's the Tupac wrap tee. Um, you know, there's a lot of different ones that, uh, could definitely compete with this one, but I think this one is so solid and as as always it's worth the wait for these guys uh, They definitely deliver it takes a while to get these boxes ready, uh, but they definitely come through This is my favorite box. I got some personals out of here uh, My favorites are probably that bad boys one is super sick that Cruella de Vil same with that all over print not all over print that big print 101 Dalmatians. So we got two of those tees. Yeah, I got that Pearl Jam for myself. We got this dope Led Zeppelin. Like all the bangers were super bangers. And I'm I'm very happy. Thank you so much, Jam Vintage. Uh, they're drop sell all the time. So you got to really try to get those boxes whenever you can. But I'm so grateful for these guys. Insane box. I'm very happy. Uh, and I will be doing a site drop on my website. 
I gotta get that up and running, figure that whole thing out.